Speaking at COP28, Planning and Development Minister Penelope Beckles has lauded this country's commitment to the Eskazu Agreement, which seeks to protect biodiversity and environmental defenders in Latin America and the Caribbean. Meanwhile, TNT's lead climate negotiator has highlighted a step in the right direction for TNT when it comes to transparency. Ryan Bechu has the latest from the United Arab Emirates. In essence, the Escazú Agreement of 2018 signed in Costa Rica aims to give environmental defenders like these across Latin America and the Caribbean the power to do so. And on Saturday, Minister of Planning Penelope Beckles told a panel discussion she is satisfied with TNT's legislative framework which gives that freedom and access to environmental activists. So our legislative framework is one of the most advanced when it comes to access to information the participation in environmental decision making and access to justice in environmental matters. TNT's lead climate negotiator, Kishan Kumar Singh, backed TNT's legislative push to make it mandatory for local carbon emitters to provide their data. At present, it is voluntary for emitters to submit data to the EMA, but a draft legislation is before cabinet awaiting approval. So this creates uh, legal certainty. However, the challenge Kumar Singh says is measuring adaptation on the island because coastline communities may face different issues than communities that, let's say, live on a hill. However, he did underscore the will to measure both the emissions of Trinidad and Tobago as well as the effects of climate change. Ryan Beju, CNC3 News, Dubai.